My friends, I hope you all are doing well. Welcome to this episode of the Outdoor Gear Review. Behind me, you can see the DoD Outdoors One Pole Tent. There's a big question that needs to be answered. Is this tent waterproof? In this episode, we are going to find out together. As it stands right now, a big wave of moisture is coming this way. The forecast is for over one inch of rain tonight going into the morning. It will be an excellent test for this tent. Go ahead, pause the video, comment down below. What do you all think? Is this Japanese teepee tent going to leak? My prediction is no, I do not think it will. But you never know folks, ever so often my predictions are incorrect. So we shall see together. So let's find out if our predictions match, right? I don't think it's going to leak. What do you think? Comment down below. If you have any questions about this tent, make sure to check out my preview. I've gone over every single aspect concerning the materials, the stats, the features of this. This is a very interesting tent. First off, I love the size of this. I like the black color. On the inside, there's a ton of space. With all of that being said though, I do have questions. Primarily, is this waterproof? I went ahead and I tied out all of the guy lines and that's because by morning, the winds could be strong roughly 20 to 30 miles an hour. So I took the time, staked this out, guided out, it's ready to go, and so am I. I wanna give you all a quick update. It's a little bit after 11 p.m. It's been raining for a few hours now. Nothing I would classify as heavy, but a good solid rain. And with that, folks, we'll just let it rain and we'll see how well this tent does. Gosh, guys, everything here is soaking wet. Good morning, everyone. Let me go ahead and explain what took place yesterday. Rain began falling around 10 o'clock last night and it has poured all night long. Rain ceased about an hour ago and now it's time to check on the DOD tent. Did it leak? What was your prediction again? Did it leak or did it not? We're about to find out. I'm hoping that the tent did not leak. So far with my testing, I've been very impressed with all the products from DOD Outdoors, which is a Japanese company. Okay, interesting. This is where we're at folks, the DOD outdoors tent leaked. For some of the leaking, I could figure out what happened. For another part of it, I cannot. So you can see that there's water here at the door on the right hand side, next to where the zipper's at for the door. 
but at the same time there's also water on the other side of the door where there's no zipper. I've taken a look at the fly. I can tell that water's come through the zipper on this side, but the other side I don't see any water drops on the inside of the fabric. So I can't say if it's come through like a seam. I can't say if it's come through a vent. No matter what, this tent has failed the waterproof test and it has leaked. The leaking that's taken place with this tent is not atrocious or anything, but it has leaked, it failed the waterproof test, and that is unfortunate. There's a lot that I like about this tent, but I'm disappointed that it's not waterproof. Water can easily make its way in through that zippered door, even though it has a storm flap over that zipper. But at the same time, water's coming in from somewhere else. Again, maybe a seam, maybe the vent, I'm not entirely sure. Now everyone, I want to hear from you. What was your prediction for this tent? Did you think it was going to leak? I did not. I was hoping that it wouldn't. Again, everything that I've tested from this company has been top notch. But obviously there's an issue here. Two issues. First off, the storm flap that goes over the zipper is not large enough to give full protection. And two, there's an issue on the other side of the tent. Make sure to comment down below and share your thoughts. What do you all think about the DoD Outdoors One Pole Tent? If you enjoyed this episode and want to see more like it, hit the thumbs up. That's a great way to support the channel. If you want to support the channel even further, you could do so on Patreon, YouTube. You could join the Wolf Pack. That too is appreciated. Take care. Be well. Strength and honor. I'll see you again soon. Bye for now. <laughs>